Hey everybody, Brian here from quantlabs.net. I just wanted to introduce you to uh, a new file I'll be uploading, uh, Python script, uh, which is really my phase two of my futures and options trading algorithm phase. Now, there's a number of uses you can use this for to measure uh, market direction and a variety of asset classes. You can also use this for futures themselves, options. Now, if you're asking me, my preferred way of trading, uh, from what I've seen and what I've researched over the years, the best asset class is definitely, definitely options. Um, with a payoff of in the magnitude of two to five, up to 10, um, I see no reason to wanna fight for like the 5% or the 12 or 15% annual when you can go after crazy option trading. And your maximum risk is the premium that you're willing to spend on each options trade. So these algorithms are from a book that I've, I've, I've highlighted in past videos. Uh, they've been, all these little algorithms all have been gleaned from the book and uh, all the chapters, everything have been put into pretty well this file, this uh, library, whatever you want to call it, but it's a script that you can use, test, and then uh, pass data into it. Now, I'll be focusing on this as a separate um, course uh, in itself to try to teach all the different concepts that come with these uh, different algorithms or equations. Uh, so that's what I'm going to be focusing on. On top of there'll be a lot more to this than, than just what I'm demoing. There's a YouTube course. There's a logic to trade all this and make trading decisions based off of this type of data. But this type of stuff is, is fairly well completed over the last few days, and we're approaching up to close to uh, 600 lines of, of various code. So I'll, up to, I'll, up, I'll upload this for all my quant lead members who want to take a look at it and uh, play around with it. I haven't tested these algorithms. I've only tested a few, but I see no reason why they shouldn't work. But it's good for reference as well. <coughs> Let me know what you think. Talk to you later.